Why are you here at 5.30? Because you're here at 5.30. See, you're here at 530. That was the God plan. Damn. We don't go on for four hours. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Sign your hand. Sign your hand? <laughs> yes, yes, I don't want anything green signed. It's so good. <laughs> <laughs> If we didn't have the fans, we wouldn't be able to go on the air, and uh, so we owe it all to them, always. I think the Dayman episode is my favorite, where they start the band. The one where they were doing the play. That's this one. That's this one? That's this one? The Nightman Commit. Yeah, see? Hilarious. Little boy, baby boy, shiny boy, I love you. <laughs> baby boy. Tiny boy, I love you, boy. Our 18-month-old son sings Day Man with us. Thank you so much. <laughs> Day Man. Oh, Jagger of the Night Man. Oh, champion of the sun. Oh, you're a master of karate and friendship for everyone. Day Man. Stay dreams. You always look to the fans. And it's going to be fun to be with them tonight. You still get the jitters at all or not? Well, I don't think I'm going to get them for this because it's really ridiculous. <laughs> They've done a really good job with the tough days. I don't really see yeah. very many. <laughs> Maybe they replaced the motion. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's just blow and jizz and cum and farts and shit all over this thing. Shit's from the butt fucking. Hi, DVD. It's exciting because, uh, you know, it's just the first uh, Always Sunny in Philadelphia live show. Troubadour's got such a history. It's like a treat to be here.
What you doing? I wrote buddy? a musical. Huh? What? I wrote a musical, dude. You uh, you wrote a musical. Yeah. Why? Oh, Why would you do that? Why? <laughs> uh, just to write a musical. I don't think there's got to be a reason, right? No, I think there does have to be a reason. No one writes a musical for no reason. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> All right. Well, this guy did. So there you go. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. No. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I see what's going on here. Who's the, uh, who's the target? Who's the mark? <laughs> yeah, you know, what's your angle? Are you gonna have an angle? <laughs> have an angle. I, I don't have an angle. You gotta have an angle. What do you yeah, mean? you have an angle. Yeah, okay, well, whose face are we shoving this musical right, in? Right, right, right. Oh, you don't shove a musical. I, I think what we all want to know is who versus. Yeah, who yes, are we doing yes. this against? Yeah, who's it against? Oh, I see what's going but, yeah. on here. Who's, uh... You guys are going to turn it into one of these things where we're going to do it against someone and it's going to be about screwing people. You know what? I wrote a musical just to write a musical, okay? But if you guys don't want to be in it and, I, you know, you don't give a shit about it, I can always find other people to play your part. Oh, so, okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't be stupid. No, 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 no. Hey, listen, man. I think we're just trying to wrap our heads around this. There's no reason to go giving away our part. No, I'll no. I'll give our parts away. We're going to do the we'll musical. Do it. Right? Do it. What's it called? Yeah. The Nightman Cometh! <laughs> All right, gather around, gather around, everybody. Gather around here, please. You guys, down front. Quick rehearsal. All right, do you feel the magic? Yes, I feel the magic. All right. Now, you guys all know Artemis, right? <laughs> Artemis was kind enough to book this fine local theater for us. Uh, thank you, Artemis. It's a beautiful place. Yeah. She also transcribed my nice work theater. into a format that you might consider more legible. And uh, also more literate because she put words to it. Yeah. So that's great. All right, Dee, thank you. No interruptions now. Thank you. Oh, uh, right off the bat here, bro, I see there's a cast list. Yeah. Um, there's a lead boy character. Who's going to be playing that role? That's going to be Mac. What? Oh, yeah! Lead, of course! Who's gonna be playing the day man? That's also Mac! What? Yeah, the lead boy becomes the day man when he defeats the night man. That's you. Two Come parts! No. Oh, yeah! Two parts! <laughs> Wait a minute. Dude, we wrote that song together. How could you get that part it's away? It's not two, it's one part. The, the kid Solid. becomes the two parts! Who's, who's playing the troll guy? <laughs> yeah. That's gonna be you, dude! I'm playing the troll guy. Who the, who the hell else would play the troll, bro? I like that. I figured you might. Can, can I do it naked? No, no one would like that. Why do you want to be naked? Because in the 70s, everybody did musicals, and they always were naked, and they always got laid. Yeah. All right, well, it's not the 70s, but I don't think you're going to be getting laid, OK? So keep your clothes on, Frank. Thank you. OK, Charlie. What is this play about? I'm a princess who lives in a coffee you shop. You work in a coffee shop. You don't read it closer. Well, why am I in love with a little boy? You're in love with a young man, Dee. You wrote little boy. Well, well, man, boy, it's a metaphor. Yeah, well, you know what? The audience is going to think I'm a child molester. I'm not cool with that. So I'm probably going to change it up a little bit. I've changed my mind. I'm playing the night man. Ah! What? Yeah, yeah. Why would you want to play the uh, Nightman? The Nightman's badass, dude. He has the eyes of a cat and does yeah. karate across the stage. <laughs> karate? Where did yeah. you write karate in the script? Yeah. He doesn't do karate. Yeah, no, I made that up, but it's going to be great, man. Oh, shit. Oh, you know what? That's great, because that frees up the lead boy role and the day man role. I'll play I both of those. That's cool. don't switching roles, man. Don't switch roles on me. We're going to switch roles. You got a guy that does cat eyes? I'm already on it. Uh. Oh, my God. All right, let's just start the first rehearsal. Come on, we got to just start rehearsing. Yeah. Let's go. Screw it. Right. Hey, one, two, three, one, two, three. Tiny boy, little boy, baby boy, I need you. Tiny boy, little boy, want to make love to you. Boy. Okay, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Wait, wait, Charlie, wait. what the fuck? <laughs> Are you kidding me? What? Boy, little boy, baby boy? Yes. You want me to say that I want to make love to a little tiny baby boy? And I'm a 
explain to you that I'm talking about the spirit of this boy as a man who's like a little boy. Okay, that's a metaphor, D. Yeah, I know. You keep using the word metaphor, but I am not convinced that you have any idea what it means. Come on. Also, just while we're talking about it, it says that I'm supposed to kiss Dennis at the end, and that is not going to happen. Yeah. Yeah, I take issue with that, man. She's my sister. Well, that's fucking gross. That's why man. I didn't want you playing the boy, bro. What? Okay, uh, what if it's just a sexually charged embrace? No. Yeah. I don't want you talking to the talent, okay? I'm gonna handle the talent. You know, if you guys don't like the song, I'll cut the song. Thank no, you, Charlie. Wait, no, wait, no. What are you doing? No, don't cut the song. I love the song. That's a great song. I want to sing it. D, this is what's gonna happen. You're gonna apologize yeah, to Charlie. Apologize. Oh, well, I'm not gonna do that because he wants me to bang this baby and I'm not comfortable. <laughs> okay, you know what? I think it's a bad idea to cut the song, Thanks, Charlie. Artemis. Yeah, think... Thanks, okay? But let me talk to, can you just, you know what, Dennis, can I talk to you for a second here? Yeah, 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 yeah. Can you take a five, bro? Yeah, here's the thing, though, man. I, I don't want to cut the song I because I... I cut the song. Yeah, I love the song. I, I need you to take a five. A uh, five minutes, though? Can you have five minutes? Only five? I want five minutes from When me. you say five, you mean... Will you take a five over there, five? man? Have a five minutes! Why are you yelling at me? You're working me up! <laughs> All right, D, the song's history. Really? We don't have to do it? Yeah, Thank you very it? much, because you can see how that's weird, right? Uh, yeah. Okay, so what are we gonna sing instead? What am I gonna sing? Uh, what's on the what's in the back there? It's the same song. I mean, the very very back, all the way back there. Nothing. Oh, good, you can sing no, that. No, come thing. on! Oh. This is like my big song, Charlie. Oh. Everybody gets a song. I know. Why don't I help you write a new You're one? You're gonna write new songs for me. me oh, like don't screw you! Oh, I'm sorry, Dee. Let me try to remember something here. Now, did Dee write a musical and bring it to Charlie? No. Charlie wrote a musical and brought it to D and the gang. And the gang likes to screw Charlie over and make it about themselves, okay? Okay, so like, you know, I could, I'll tell you what I could do. I could cut the song, okay, because I wrote it, all right? I could have Artemis do the song, okay, because you didn't write it. No. Or I could strap on a wig and do the song myself. So you tell me, Little Miss, all that. What's it gonna be, song or no song? No. I know you song, never were gonna... we could just Come on, Dennis, what are you doing over there, it. man? What are you doing? Uh, I'm eating baby Snickers because you've made me very uncomfortable. <laughs> well, I didn't. You, she worked me up. Come on, you're yelling. Just Jack's and uncomfortable too. You guys are putting me up to here, and I, I don't, don't want to be here. He's eating like, like 50. So, Look, just come on stage and we'll do the musical the way it's written. What if I just throw a couple of different You're taking a 30. Oh, take You're a 30. taking a 30 all the way up there, Adam. Frank, we're doing your number. Nice. Let's go. Huh? Yeah, Ch boy. Cholto. Let's go, over yeah, here. Want me? Right here, bro. Yeah. Cholto. Oh. 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 You gotta pay the troll toll to get into this boy's hole. You gotta pay the troll toll to get in. If you want this baby boy's hole, you gotta pay the troll toll. You gotta pay the troll toll to get in. All right, uh, Frank, let me stop you for a second there. I like what you're doing. It sounds to me, though, like you're saying boy's hole. <laughs> and clearly it's soul and Artemis. You did write soul, I right? I did write soul. Okay. You wanna pay the troll toll to get into this boy's hole? Gotta pay the troll toll to right, get in. When you drag the S like that, it sounds like you're Are you chewing gum? Yeah. I said, no I said no gum, everybody. Said no I'm going to need your gum. Unprofessional. Give me the gum. Give me the gum, Frank. <laughs> Charlie, can I bring something up? Yeah. I think we have to be really careful how we do the rape scene. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's very, very, very... Yeah. What rape? There's no rape scene yeah, in the musical. A, that's a sensitive subject. Yeah, what, are talking, sensitive what are you talking... What are you talking about? What rape scene? The, the, rape, the rape scene in Act 2 where I, I pay the toll to Frank and then I rape Dennis. Yeah. That's in here. You don't rape him, you become him. Why is he rape to me? Nobody rape. seems to get this. He doesn't rape him? Look, it's so simple. When you come into the room, you're going after that boy's soul, okay? So you cross uh -huh. over the stage, come over here to get his soul. And I'll uh -huh. be asleep. Yeah, you lay back. I'll be asleep on the bed. You lay back. Oh, I answer here and cross the stage. Yes, cross the Perfect. stage. I feel like I'm gonna do a clinic for everybody, sort of showcase some of my martial arts. Here. I'd rather, I'd rather you did it. Then I'd I'll rather to, you didn't do I'll that. I'll get to this point here. I really feel like the people are gonna want to see that. I don't know when I get to this point here, I'm gonna pounce on him like a cat. Ready? 
I, I'll, I'll add a line here. I'll add a line here. Ready? Meow. No, man, no. That. All right, fine. Jesus Christ, leave it to that dude. Okay. All right, once he gets near you, you sense him, bro. You start to sense him. How right? do I sense him? Like a wild, wild animal about to get raped. Ah. Yeah. All right, this is why I don't want you talking to the talent. Stop saying rape, everybody. Charlie, this will be great. Frank, you want to take that blanket, throw it over us, and then that way you can't see the penetration from the audience. Yes. Yeah. Yes, dude. That's what we'll do. That's going to lay some of your fears, Charlie. Because with the blanket, that'll make the raping see I'm sorry. The sexing from behind feel a little bit more classy. Okay, so here's what I'll do is I'll, I'll pin his leg up like this, and then I'll, I'll, I'll fire into you, and you should scream. And then I'll scream. You guys, I'm like there. I'm like way past where I thought I could ever go. You know, and I don't, no one's gonna enjoy that. You know what? I'm taking a walk. I gotta take a walk. Right, we'll, we'll, we'll I'm giving myself. Here. I'm taking a walk. Yeah, that's good. Huh? <laughs> you know what? There's no point. There's no point in you doing this to me right now if Charlie's not gonna watch. That's kind of the whole point. I want him to see it. You're right. Is this one of your walking places? Where I have mace. Okay, don't spray. I know what you have. <laughs> uh, oh my God! Uh, check it out. <laughs> this is crazy. Um, I got a free ticket for you to see a musical that I wrote. Yeah. Wow! Oh wow! A free, a free ticket for a plaw that you wrote. I don't want to go see that. You don't want to. I don't want to see you that. You don't want to see it. All right, hang on a second. Uh, you know, let's try bargaining. Let's try it. Oh, please, yes. Let's okay. see what you have to bargain. Try this one on for size. If you come and you see this musical, uh huh, I will leave you alone like for the rest of your life. Really? Yeah. So you're not gonna follow me home now or <laughs> ever, and you're not gonna look in my windows when I'm changing, oh, well. and you're not gonna have the emergency room call me at three in the morning and tell me that oh you've been in a terrible car accident. And I should hurry there. Well, it was really great that you came. That was awesome. You listed me as your emergency contact. I consider you my I emergency am not contact. That. I have to go. I, I hang have... on a second. You're always brushing off, and I'm trying to. Um, I'm like, I'm. This is like, this is. I'm. I'm trying. Something's telling me not to give up, and like, <laughs> like. So I'm. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. This is like the last straw. Like, if you come and see this musical, I'll leave you alone. I'm like a ghost. I won't come to the coffee shop. You're never going to see me again. Like, this is, I'm, that's how serious oh I am. Oh, my God. That would be so, so amazing. I, 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 this is it. This is like the last straw right here. Time for the, if you take the ticket. You can, oh, hey, nice. You're not going to regret it. Oh, I regret it already. All right. I was, I was going that yeah, way. Yeah, because that's my way. Well, I gotta go all the way you around the block now. You should go the other one. That doesn't make this a lick of sense. This way is mine. All right, I'm going. I'm going. Yo, Charlie. What? What's going on, dude? I'm not ready to start. When are we gonna start? I'm gonna start when I'm ready to start. These people have been waiting here for 20 minutes. People, uh, they came, they paid, they're not gonna go anywhere. I just, look. oh my God, she's here. She's here, she came, I can't believe she came, she's here. Okay, gather in, guys, right down front. Hey guys, gather in, I want you guys to meet Gladys. Right, Artemis, can you bring in Gladys for a second? Bring in Gladys. Okay. This is Gladys, okay? This is Gladys, all right? Now, I know she looks a lot like Rita Perlman, but she's Gladys, okay? Now, now Gladys is gonna be in charge of all the lighting and music cues in the show, all right? So relax, she's got it covered. She's like 100 years old, that's she's ridiculous. Good. Oh my God. I, I forgot to tell you. Yeah. Calvin Coolidge was a good friend of mine. Okay. You didn't forget to tell me, but tell me the Calvin Coolidge story all morning, all right? So, how many times? Like a hundred times. Wow. Okay, so at a certain point, he needs. 
No, shush me. No, you're For nice doing you. Okay, you know what, Artemis? I don't have time for this. All right. Get her up in the booth. John, get her up in the booth. Gladys, this way. Gladys. That way, get her. Go. Go over there. Now, Charlie, a couple of last minute things. What? I love the song that you wrote for me. Yeah. I'm gonna add a line at the end of it. What? Yeah, it's gonna sum up the whole play for me. The, the crowd's gonna love it. Dude, your solo is perfect. Don't okay, add it. I gotta you go want. pop my cat eyes in, bro. I don't want you wearing Good cat luck, eyes. Guys. Why also, is he wearing it? Ooh, Charlie, me too. A couple of quick things. I can't really move my arm so well in this, so I might rip the pits. Do not rip that costume. It's a rental. Okay, well, uh, one other thing. I wrote a song. I'm going to throw what? it in. I think no. you're going to love it. Do not add you're songs. You're going to have to trust me on this. Who throws in songs? You're going to love it, Charlie. I'm going to do it anyway, okay? I will smack your face show. off of your face. I'll smack it off. What? Oh, no, dude. What's up with you, bro? Ah, uh, shit, man. What? What's wrong? I don't feel good, dude. I don't feel good at all, man. I don't feel good at all. Because you've been eating baby Snickers? Yeah, man. I begged you, man. I begged you not to eat baby Snickers. Yeah, but it's the only thing. I'm so nervous, man. I don't know what I'm doing. You're going to be fine, man. You just got to power through right. the Snicker. My stomach hurts, and I don't think I'm going to be fine, man. I can't, like, um... Remember uh, my your lines. lines. Oh, I can't Jesus, remember my dude. lines, dude. All right, look. Frank will just feed you your lines and you'll be good. Hey, okay, okay. do me a favor. Don't start the show. I have man. to start Please the show. Please don't start the show. The people will leave. I don't know my lines. You gotta figure it out. Uh, you gotta figure it out. Artemis, start the show. Oh, shit. Please. Oh, oh, come shit. on, man. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, one and all. And welcome. Oh, no. And welcome to tonight's production of The Nightman Cometh. Thank you. My name is Artemis Dubois, and yes. And I am the co-director of this production. You're the assistant director. I'm the co You're not co even close I'm the co-director. Co you know, I have always longed for a life in the theater. In fact, I come from a long line of thespians. And when I was a little child, I remember my father, Big Daddy Dubois, Why saying, are you hamming it up? Just tell oh, them about the fire story. exits and the cell phones. All right, okay, everybody, please turn off your cell phones. Don't take any photos with Flash, or somebody will come and take your camera. Also, when the fire starts... If the fire starts! Don't say uh, when the fire starts! If, if, You're gonna if, freak them out! If the fire starts... I need everybody to run patiently to the exits. Don't tell them on them. either side of the stage Just so start you it. do Just not start burn it. They've waited to long death. enough to start okay. it. Okay, and everybody, welcome. Without any further ado, we present to you the Nightman Comet. <laughs> Boy, my toesy woozy woozy is itchy witchy witchy. Come and scratch them, boy. I said, my toesy woozy woozy is itchy witchy. Come and scratch them, boy. Dennis, come and scratch my toes. You're making me look like an asshole. Ah, oh, shit. Scratch, you got a line, line, speak. Yeah, uh, yeah, oh, uh, uh, you, oh, uh, you, master, your toes are for, I, oh, I'm, you uh, <laughs> uh, your toes you are like, my toes can be itched all day, you idiot? A moron. Go ahead, speak, say your line. Yo, um, I am a foolish boy. I am boy. not a boy. You are a boy. I am a idiot. boy. You're a boy. I'm a boy. Start the music. What? I got a troll in my hole. That's right. My hole of an apartment. I control your soul. That's my department. Everywhere there's trolls living, living in your home. Right up your home, Making man. Making eat their bowls, make you rub their fat rolls. Rub their bowls. And all of this and more. Yeah. I got, got a, a troll, troll in my hole. hole. I got a troll in my hole. Everywhere there's trolls living, yeah, yeah. 
ride. It's so strange, but appealing. I feel good. Tiny boy, oh. little boy, oh. baby boy, I need you. Ooh. Tiny boy, yeah. little boy, yeah. I want to touch you. Just to be clear, I did not write that song and have never had sex with a child or a minor or anything like that. Just to be clear, I am a more experienced actor and that should be taken into account during your applause at the end. Oh, also, most men find me to be an eight or nine out of ten. And I happen to be available to any interested men who'd like to get my number after the show. Yeah. HIV test preferred. You goddamn bitch, you're not gonna have a face by the time I'm done with you. your toll, troll. <laughs> your boy waits last. The boy's soul is mine. Give me that hole. Feast your eyes on this. Just the bad guy? You don't know shit. You don't know shit about me. I wrote a little song so you can understand why I do the things I do a little bit more better. It's called It's Nature. Shit happens.
Some people are born skinny. Some people are born fat. Some people are born evil with the eyes of a cat. Yeah! It's nature. Shit happens. There's nothing you can do. Or what made Jeffrey Dahmer tick? Or Hitler hate the Jews? It's nature. Shit happens. There's nothing to be done. Pol Pot committed genocide. Darth Vader killed for fun, fun. Why does everybody hate me? When will it all pass? I'm going to bend over so you can kiss my balls. It's nature. It happens. God made me what I am. Just like Charlie Manson, Michael Moore, and Son of Sam. It's nature. Shit happens. I'm not trying to be coy. That's just the way God made me, bitches. <laughs> That's why I sodomize that bull. Africa! Well, here I am again. Alone in my lonely room. It's the next night. It's not the same night as what you just saw. That was. <laughs> there was a whole day that happened, but you didn't see that day. Well, it was a lot of the same stuff, you know? A lot of like rubbing rolls and eating moles and scrubbing the trolls' bowls. Ah, uh, mean old nasty troll. But I don't know. Tonight feels different somehow. I don't know what it is. I suppose the night man will be here soon. I sure don't like the night man. I don't know. Something I feel like, and I don't know what, but something is about to change. Nightman, sneaky and mean, spider inside my dreams. I think I love you. You make me want to cry. You make me want to die. I love you, 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 Nightman. Down with your strong hands You pin me down and I try to fight you Come inside me and fill me up And I become the Nightman The spirit of the Nightman fills me up And I become him Just two men sharing the night It might seem wrong but it's just right It's just two men sharing each other It's just two men like love and brothers One on top One's on bottom, one inside, and one is out. One is screaming, he's so happy. The other's screaming, a passionate dog. Feeling so wrong and right, man. Feeling so wrong and right, man. I can't fight you, man. When you come inside, pin me down with your strong hands. And I Passionate, passionate nightmare. No. Something needs to change. I must kill the nightman. I got a 
another richy witchy witch on my toesy woesy woes, boy. Come and scratch it, boy. No. No. Yes. Boy, come and scratch my toes. No, Antonio. I control you and your soul. Come and scratch my toes, boy. Yeah, you don't control shit, Antonio. <laughs> you know why? Because I'm not a boy anymore. I'm a man. I was transformed by the strong and musky power of true love. And now... I am the day man. What the fuck is that? You know what it is, bitch. <laughs> bang! <laughs> bang! <laughs> bang! <laughs> bang! <laughs> bang! <laughs> bang! <laughs> click! <laughs> click! 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 Ah, shit, I thought I had more bullets. Now there's only one last thing to take care of. Yeah. What's up, bitches? Where's the boy? Boy's gone. You can't tell me what to do. I didn't tell you what to do, and you're skipping a line. You can't tell me what to do, Still bitch. <laughs> skipping the, De Dennis, it's the same remember. line. Dennis, listen here. Uh, day man, I'm totally gonna kick your ass, uh, bro. You know what, man? I am the ruler of darkness. I am the master of light. I'm the day man. Whatever, bitch. I'll give you some whatever, no, don't bitch. Don't now. Just don't tell me when and when not to improv. defeated the evil that was here. Yeah, naturally, I'm the day man. <laughs> well, once you were a boy, but now you have become a man, and now I am in love with you. You got that right. And guess what? I'm in love with you. I am the light and darkness, master of word and song. You 
No, 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 I will never marry you. And not only that, but I kept up the end, my end of the bargain, so I never have to see you again. No, hang on a second. There's a, have a drink. There's like a whole I've, musical There's that not happened. enough drinks to have. There's, there's drinks. I'm just, trying to, I'm just trying to get it straight. You are saying no? Oh, I'm saying no. Oh, I'm definitely, definitely saying no. Boo to you. All right. Um, well, I never signed anything, so... I'll probably see you around the coffee shop pretty soon, all right? All right. This play was stupid, and you're all stupid oh, for liking it. It's all right. Oh, my God. Uh, well, that's, that didn't go how I expected it. That was good. It was a great, the musical was great. Yeah. And you did a great job, uh, and she's not uh, worth it. Uh, you see that, uh, that, that douchebag from the Wonder Years came in. Yeah. Uh, that was awesome. That was awesome. Where is this other That's people? worth it. 
up there? Yeah. I just uh, would like to. Hey, we should do a bow. I just, I just want to point out. Let's do a bow. Let's do a bow. Oh, take a bow. Let's, Let's do a bow. bow. Yeah, yeah, was... <laughs> All right. All right. Rob, is this your first taste of rock stardom? Um, no. What else? Uh, I had a little band. Did you really? Back in the uh, 90s. What'd you do? Uh, I played bass guitar. Oh, yeah. Yep. What are they called? Pearl Jam. Is that right? Yep. Were you thrown out, or what, at what point did you part with? No, still together, putting on albums. <laughs> okay. Surfing. Yeah, but another band took that same name. Huh? Some other band took that same name. Where? Who? A student named Eddie Vedder. No, he's my band. He's my, he's, he's the lead singer. No, a different Eddie Vedder. This guy's like... Eddie Vedder from Torrance? He's also from Torrance, yeah. He's also from Torrance? That's him. But this band's like global, like... I, you know how you guys play at like VFW lodges and, and church yeah. groups and stuff? They love us. These guys, Pearl like, Pearl if you go into a bar and look at a jukebox, there will be a band called Pearl Jam. Right. A different one. A different one. That you're not in. You should check them out. <laughs>